FIFA packs are a waste of money and coins. But what if I told you that there was a way to get unlimited FIFA packs for a very, very, very small, small cost? Just, just tiny, tiny cost. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to get unlimited cheap packs in FIFA 22. Okay, let's go. In my last video showing off the cheap and vape, I said if you like that video, comment it down below and subscribe. If you knew, you could be winning yourself 4,600 FIFA points. So here's the, uh, here's the winner. From the last one, I'll tell you what, the boys, we'll do it again on this video. Like Perfect. this video, comment down below, subscribe if you are new, and you could potentially win yourself 4,600 FIFA points. Winner announced in the next video. And if you do want to get yourself any FIFA coins, make sure to click the link in the description and check out Mule Factory. Use the code LE5CHEAP for a spicy little discount. However, the boys, let's get into the video. <laughs> yeah, boy. So, boys, jumping into this video, EA have released something which makes getting easy packs in this game just, oh, blissimo, chef's kiss. The league SBCs are honestly perfect for building up some packs, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it in the best way for the cheapest way possible as well, so don't worry, it should be all good. Um, look at the twos, man. You'll look in the top left though and go, Lewis, this is so easy for you. You've got one million coins. Now, boys, do not worry. I will sort you all out. If this video gets over a thousand likes in 48 hours, I'll show you boys the best way possible to make coins in FIFA 22 right now. So if you want to see that this weekend, just drop a like. Even if you don't want the giveaway, just... just, just, just what like i said at the start gold packs just aren't worth it i mean you've got preview packs which they're, they're not too bad are they but between me and you yeah have you ever got anything decent from a preview pack like this is <laughs> case in point why this is just pointless so the best way to get some unlimited packs i will talk about the method as much as i can do you're going to be starting off with bronze packs and before you click off and go this guy's talking well i'm just just hear me out yeah just please just give me just give me a few minutes of your time what else are you doing i mean we're all sat in playing fifa it's freezing I mean, you're not going outside are you i've not been outside in about a year so it doesn't matter what the weather is <laughs> regardless though you want to go and open yourself some 750 coin packs fairly easy and then once you've opened the pack this is what you need to do you need to get rid of all the contracts and all the rubbish you can take a look at the kits if you want to maybe these kits go for a little something something maybe list those up for 200 coins so basically you're gonna be using the bronze pack method now if you don't know what the bronze pack method is don't worry sit yourself down i'll tell you everything you need to know knowledge so basically how the bronze pack method works is you open bronze packs and you sell the contents of the pack for a profit so you're basically trying to recoup some of the investment but you can sort of then combine that with the league sp PCs and go from there. So for example, this McCune guy right here is currently selling for around 500 coins. I could sell him on for 400 coins. And then if there was anyone else who went for a little something, something, maybe I could sell them on. What about you, Villa? He's going for 200 coins, not worth it. What about you? Are you going for anything? Ah, 200 coins, not bad. So overall from that, we make 600 coins. We've got ourselves some players that we can use in a few other things and then we can quick sell the rest. It's free real estate. You need to open yourself quite a lot of bronze packs to be honest with you. I've spent around 150, 200,000 coins today just on bronze packs and you can see with some of the some of the pulls that we've had some players go for a hell of a lot the premier league boys at the minute are yeah they, they are very very expensive so i i'd say get on this now whilst these are fairly expensive obviously going into black friday you don't really want to be spending on lightning rounds i know that you will do but I don't know, I, I just don't see the point. Me personally, I'm not gonna be opening any packs on Black Friday because I'm saving everything pretty much for Team of the Year. So this is the grind that I'm gonna be using for Team of the Year. So I thought I may as well show it off, do you know what I mean? Welcome to the Dream Factory. So what's so good about these League SBCs? So EA have actually changed this up. Now, it, last year what it was, was individual teams from those leagues so you could use bronze pack method for that this method has been working honestly for years so for example right if i go over to the saudi professional league now look at this instead mbs pro league is at exactly 11 which is bob on and they actually don't give out two bad packs as well so this comes into the next little method that you're going to use so we can come over here and go maybe over to the premium silvers or small prime so i'll tell you what sorry let's go to the small prime silver player pack so for this i need exactly 11 mbs pro league players so if i just go over here go over to to the squad builder go over to the league i can change it to the mbs pro league just by flicking through all this where is it hello hello mbs pro oh there you are sweet i can just build the squad by pressing triangle squad build is complete boom lovely i've pretty much already got the squad complete and that is absolutely bob on for me lovely stuff i'm just going to take these golds out and just replace them with this cool 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 beans cool beans players from one club max one wait what this cheeky chappy needs to come out and we need to go over here and chuck this in. Okay. We go over here and we chuck this in. Okay. We go over here and chuck this in. Do 
not. Anyway, thanks for a bit of jiggery pokery. I've managed to sort it. Anyway, this is what I'm talking about. So you can build up your club and then you can start to go and stack these packs. Now, with the tradable ones, when you open them, it's completely up to you what you do with them. Obviously, with the league SBCs, some stuff is really, really expensive. And then just with daily SBCs in general, you can sell that stuff on or you can just keep it and then try and maybe work out a league SBC somewhere. So taking a look at all these right here, you can just filter through and just see how much they're going for. I've got 900 coins there back from that. Parath is going for about 300 coins. Franco looks like he's going for about 300 coins as well. Gonda is going for 350, 750, 600. Um, we've probably made, I reckon, about 1.5k ish on that pack so then i've done one of the sections for that group right there and then as i keep going through and through and through with the bronze packs lovely stuff sorted and we can just move on to maybe a different one if we want to like for example you've got the premier league one that gives you a rare place pack so for this one it's exactly 11 plays from uncle max one bronze still plays minimum seven yeah this is this, this is this madness the good thing is as well even if you've not got everything for that pack at that time what you can do instead is just go over here go over to the premier league and go over to your bronzes in the premier league and see if there's any who are just tradable like this thompson guy for example I wouldn't have known that he would go for anything, but now I can just go boom, sort it, 2k, lovely stuff. But you might be thinking to yourself, Lewis, this is all well and good, but what about all the NAF stuff that isn't from a certain league? And that's where these come in, the bronze upgrades. Now you can do these and farm yourself even more players for those league SBCs. Now again, what you want to be doing for this is go over to the squad builder and then you just want to go over here and go over to advanced filters by clicking r2 and then go over here go over to newest go over to untradeable and then boom sorted lovely stuff fair enough so with that stuff that maybe doesn't go for one of those popular leagues you can chuck them into the bronze upgrades the silver upgrades and the gold upgrades and get yourself even more packs from that which is very very good indeed and with the addition of one of these new spcs if we go over to it whereabouts is it whereabouts is it hello talk to me 81 plus double upgrade this is a very good time to get these ground out seven days left on these as well and if you go over and take a look at the requirements for this if we take a look just underneath me it says rare players min 11 gold 50 cam sorted and if we go over to our pack section and go over here you will be able to see we've got a two silver players pack and then with this we can either put it into the league sbc if it's a duplicate we can sell the duplicate that we've already got if it's an off league it goes into the next section with those silvers you can probably guess what we're going to do we're going to go over to the silver upgrade we're going to do the exact same thing as before go over to the squad builder we want to set this over to silver they then want to go over here to low to high these guys are all loaded in so we go over here go over here and then we submit that sorted lovely We've got ourselves some gold commons which again we'll go into the next one going over to the gold upgrade we go over here once again go over to squad builder you want to set the quality to gold and with this one instead of doing it like untradeable and stuff like that make sure that the rating is definitely on low to high because you don't want to be chucking anything in that you don't want to get rid of like your full team for example don't ever play yourself don't ever play yourself don't ever play yourself don't ever play yourself so like this one, I've tried to use as many off leagues as I can. Sometimes some gold rares will slip in as well. But boom, sorted. You get yourself a two rare gold players pack. And then with that, you can go into the final step, which is going to be the 81 plus double upgrade. So there we go, boys. We managed to get ourselves an 81 plus double upgrade done. And obviously, without me starting off with bronze packs, I wouldn't be able to do stuff like this. And this is how it all works. It's just you recycling stuff from the bronze packs into different places. And admittedly, it takes a while, but it's unlimited cheap packs in FIFA 22, do you know what I mean? Let's see what we get from this 81 plus. I mean, we've got some decent stuff in packs at the minute. It's a very, very nice team of the week. Can we get anything good from it though? Oh, hey, it's not so bad. It's going to be a board. It's going to be a left back French. Eee <laughs> That could be better. If you enjoyed this video of me talking about how to get unlimited packs in FIFA 22, you'd really like my other content trading and more pack stuff. I'll just subscribe here to check out my new content. But boys, it's 26. Lewis, how to get unlimited packs in FIFA 22. And I am off.